Thank you for joining us on this 20th anniversary of the remembrance of the attacks on the World Trade Center and other locations on September 11, 2001. On this day 20 years ago, 2,997 people died as a direct result of the attacks on the World Trade Center in New York City and others at the Pentagon and still others on Flight 93 that crashed in Shanksville, Pennsylvania. Indeed, a horrific day that will remain burned in our memories forever. But the effects of that infamous day carry on to today and beyond. What we don't hear much about is the more than 22,000 first responders and others that were in the area of the World Trade Center on that day that have gotten sick due to toxic materials in the air and on the pile. More than 3,900 people have died as a result of the illnesses that occurred that day. And it's getting worse. By the end of 2021, many expect that the number of people that will have died from their toxic exposure from 9-11 will exceed 5,000. Indeed, a very terrible day. Let us take a moment to honor and remember all those who died and are still dying today. And now let us pray. Holy God, creator of all people and all nations, it is with sorrow and apprehension we remember the tragic events that occurred on this day. We lift to you in prayer all those who died in the Twin Towers, at the Pentagon, and on United Airlines Flight 93. We entrust them to you, to your loving care. Console their families, friends, and all who continue to mourn this loss in the hope that all who trust in you find peace and rest in your kingdom. We pray for those who courageously responded to provide aid and comfort to the afflicted. May their painful memories of that day be healed and transformed into strength and positive resolution. We also pray for ourselves as we seek your strength and guidance. We live in the aftermath of this tragedy and under the shadow of future attacks of aggression. We stand in need of your assistance. Enable us, Father God, to put an end to fear by resolving to live lives that are based on respect for one another, by resolving to abide in a peaceful manner and never settle disagreements in our lives in a violent way, by resolving not to fall into the trap of blaming entire ethnic groups, races, or religions in response to acts of hostility, by resolving that justice, not revenge, is prevail in our world. Let us resolve that in the face of hatred, we will show love that in times of despair, we will be voices of hope and creators of new dreams, that in times of darkness, we will be sources of light. Let us resolve that we never regard forgiveness as weakness, but rather as a source of strength in our lives and in our world. And let us honor the memory of these nearly 3,000 individuals who died on September 11, 2001, and the more than 3,900 citizens, neighbors, and friends who have died from the effects of 9-11 since. By resolving with your help, Almighty God, to truly live this way, that you may be glorified and your love may be known to others through us. Amen.